going to have to get rid of the trash and clear this place out because we're about to apply a fantastic looking epoxy floor coating to the garage floor. Once the floor is completely cleared, the first step is cleaning it to ensure that there's nothing here to prevent the epoxy from sticking. The cleaner is a mild acid solution, so there's plenty of rinsing followed by ample drying time. The coating itself is made up of two parts which have to be mixed together to form the epoxy a few minutes before it's applied. While it sets, I'm making sure there's no dust or debris left on the floor to mar the finish. Although this stuff looks like paint and is applied like paint, it's very different in one aspect. When we mix those two different parts, we started a chemical reaction. That's what will make this stuff stick to the concrete like nobody's business. But it also means we have a limited window of time in which to work with it before it loses its ability to bond. There's no capping up the can and going to lunch once you start this job. After we cover a small area, we apply the decorative paint chip to it before moving on to coat the rest of the floor. But I'm a good flake man. I can put these flakes out pretty good. <laughs> This stuff is just what this garage needed to finish it off. 